I tell my husband this all the time. Do you know how much money you save making your coffee at home? It is the first thing. It is the start of your day every day. It's more important than who you wake up with. This is Tamron Hall, barista, former co-host of The Today Show, Emmy award-winning talk show host, author, and proud resident of the west side of Manhattan, which is why we met up one rainy morning at the Empire Diner on 22nd and 10th. It's a special place for me because my son, I mark so many things by his age, and I remember when I was taking him here in a stroller. I remember when he was old enough to sit in the booth, when he was old enough to decide what table he wanted. We're here to talk about her new novel, Watch Where They Hide. But I realized that in talking about the protagonist, Jordan Manning, we're really talking about Tamron, a black woman working her way up at a TV station, reporting on crime. Stop me if this sounds familiar. I wanted her to be this almost vigilante in many ways. She crosses a lot of lines, she puts herself in dangerous situations, and you're wondering, what are you thinking? You're a reporter who wants to be an anchor, but at the heart of it, she is a person who is fighting for what's right while she can't decide what's right for her own life. Tamron, for her part, most certainly has. It's validating, you know, I'm a woman over 50 who lost her dream job at 48. She's talking about her stint on the Today Show, which ended suddenly in 2017. One job does not define you, you define you. But today, having the show here, while it has that beat of New York, that pop, 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 people from around the world are in my audience every day. And they have helped turn Tamron Hall, the show, into a rare daytime TV success story. All of our shows for five seasons, each one is like Do you have any pet peeves about the city? <laughs> <laughs> you can't be a New Yorker and not have pet peeves. What's top of mind these it days? starts with a T. The trash. Amen. But man, she loves it here. I don't think I've ever shared this with anyone. And it makes me a little misty-eyed. When we're driving back in from our house on Long Island, the Alicia Keys Empire State of Mind came on. And my son once, he started like, why don't you play the New York song? And so now whenever we come back home, I say, you ready? And he's like, mommy, play the New York song. Oh, I'm gonna start crying. It oh. gives me the chills. It, I don't know why I'm crying. And we're like, New York. And it's like singing at the top of our lungs and you're coming over the city and when you love something you see it warts and all and i know that we live a great life and i'm very lucky working in this city but oh, I have a, uh, thank you I know, I, i'm like <laughs> our coffee is turned to tears but it's like this surreal moment because you well, know because you've like you've made it i feel like the world kind of rallied around you after all the today show nonsense <laughs> I feel like definitely New York rally. <laughs> and once you've won New York, you've won the world. I put it that way. With an extra shot of Tamron Hall on the west side, I'm Jamie Stelter, New York One. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. For more stories in your communities, click the subscribe button right here. You can also download our app or watch us on TV for the latest news and weather updates every 10 minutes and more. We'll see you then.